Yo, what's up? Anyway, so uh, today it'll be kind of a weird video because I'm not gonna be promoting my Discord, but uh, my other friend's Discord, uh, CQs. Uh, he made a bunch of stuff right now. He's currently recording a video over there. So uh, right here, I'm going to show you guys how to make a chimp lab barrier shader. So kind of like the horror barrier. It'll at the end of it, it'll kind of look like this. It moves, it works totally fine, it's a little blurry. You can add a light source around it if you if you like. So anyway, let me let me let my finish uh thingy because uh well anyway, so first off, I am going to put the uh the Discord link in the description so you can join and download the package. Yes, it is going to be a Unity package, so you will be able to import it, uh, kind of easy. There he is, making the zip lines. Anyway, so, <coughs> let this load, and, that should be good. Okay, that's a little broken. Anyway, I'll fix it. Whoa. I'll fix it later, don't worry about it. Whoa! Anyway, whatever. So. First of all, we want to go just make a plane. Or a cube, or whatever. I recommend making a Pro Builder cube, so you can just like kind of like flatten it out like this. Stretch it. Make it a little taller, so it'll be a barrier. It'll generally look good. When you import it, the shader will be in materials. It'll be in here. Barrier effect. It'll be like that. You just drag it on there, and that should be good. And if you want your monster to kind of like, well, you you probably already know how to make the monster not go through walls and like not see it through walls. So basically, you just do that with this. Uh, and yeah, that's uh, basically the shader effect. <laughs> that was a short video, but like, uh, I mean, it works. And as you can see in the background, it does make stuff blurry. So it's literally just the chimp lab thingy, but a little bit edited. So yeah, I'll I'll be doing everything in just a second. Anyway, so I hope you enjoyed this video, and uh, see you next one. Bye.